If you're looking where to PG a night, the Forgotten Tomb of Edron is the place to go. This spawn is located in Edron, to the northeast of the city, and the only thing you need to access is a rope and shovel. Make sure to have enough pots and a devouring ring, because there will be a few blue digins on this tomb, and they can get you drunk and it lasts for quite a bit. So make sure to use the ring on those cases. I covered this spawn briefly on my video of kiting, which if you haven't seen already, then you should definitely check out, because here will be important to be on point with your kiting. The density of monsters per room is too high and if you stand still you can easily get surrounded. In terms of danger, it's not gonna kill you if you have enough potions, but it will make you waste more and be more difficult to hunt, so please kite the monsters. Personally, I recommend to hunt after 50, because by then you will have strong potions and that makes hunting so much easier. But if you want to PG even earlier, you can hunt after 35 when you get the Exorius spell. The way to hunt it, besides kiting the monsters, is just going straight to minus 2 and then following the path to the last floor and then go backwards. At level 50, I was coming to the spawn with 190 small manas and 40 strong healths, because at the moment of recording, knights still couldn't use strong manas, but the point is that with that amount of potions, I was able to go to the last floor and back to the start and leave with just a few potions left and lasting about 20 minutes. There is plenty of reasons to hunt here besides the experience. First is that it can be profitable on both new servers and old ones. In the case of new servers with the cheap cost of potions, the gold and normal drops will cover your waste. In the case of old servers, the flask of embalming fluid that the mummies drop is pretty valuable as it is needed for the death protection in Bumen, so make sure to sell those in the market. Second, there is a high variety of monsters that are easy to complete the bestiary of, and lastly, besides at the start of a server, this spawn tends to be pretty empty especially the lower floors, but as for the experience, at level 50 I was on average at 240k and peaks of 250k an hour. This was with a 72 plus 4 skills and use using tier 1 imbuements of mana and crit. Obviously, better skills and also the use of strong mana potions should increase it further, and also higher levels with more AoE spells which for example, I came back at level 80 with just adding Exorium Mint to the rotation and the experience was 380k on average with a skills of 83. Unfortunately, I didn't come back after 90 with Exorium Grand, so I don't know what the experience will be, but I will expect it to be around the 500k. Let us know how much XP you make on this spawn and at what level on the comments below. With that, I will end this video. Thank you for watching and consider supporting the channel by subscribing or supporting directly with Tibia Coins to Goodie Donation. Thank you and until next time.